What's up, travelers? Today I'm going to talk about some bad news and good news about triple banners. The introduction of triple banners to Genshin Impact has been a topic of much speculation and discussion among players. Many have been curious about whether this feature will become a reality, and if so, when we can expect to see it implemented. The idea of triple banners gaining traction is largely rooted in the game's evolving character roster. The demand for reruns of older characters alongside the introduction of newer ones has led to a potential need for triple banners. Double banners were initially introduced to ensure that each character had at least one rerun per year, excluding the most recent additions. If you examine the pattern with Inazuma and Sumeru characters, you'll notice that every character received a rerun except for the newest one in Sumeru, Baiju. As Genshin Impact continues to introduce more characters, including those from the upcoming Fontaine region, the need for additional banner options becomes increasingly evident. This suggests that we might see triple banners as early as the 4.6 update and beyond. While the concept of triple banners comes with both advantages and disadvantages, such as shorter waiting times for character reruns, but potentially confusing choices for players. It's clear that the game developers are committed to ensuring that all characters have their chance to shine. In conclusion, the prospect of triple banners in Genshin Impact seems likely, and players can anticipate their arrival in the near future. So what do you think? Let me know your thoughts in the comments until next time.